What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kat. This is my channel and this is another thrift haul because I have been going thrifting way too much for my own good. So I went to two thrift stores today and I thought I would show you what I got because I got a pretty decent haul. So let's get into it. So the first place that I went was Goodwill and I spent $13. So I will have a video coming up on my channel which is going to be a like houseplant tour because I've now been obsessed with houseplants enough that um I feel like I can do that so I've been buying more pots from oh my god that was loud I've been buying more pots for my plants so I picked this little guy up um it was originally an edible arrangement one and Goodwill had it for $3.99 yellow tags were half off so I got this for $1.99 Next up, we have another pot vase thing. I don't know what this was originally because it does have like a ridge on it, like it had a lid. Um, but I thought it would be really cool if I like probably filled it up with a bunch of rocks or something and then put a succulent in it. I've been loving succulents lately. So um, I need to put some real plants in here. I've got fake ones, but I want some real plants up here. Um, but I picked this one up. I saw this one last time I was there and it was full price. Full price was $1.99, but mama didn't want to pay $1.99, so I paid 99 cents for this. So the last pot that I got was this one. It is amazing. Sorry, you can see my ring light, but um, I love the detailing on this. It's really pretty. This one was $5.99 or $4.99. Um, looks like it was just put out on the floor on the 18th of... February so just recently um, it doesn't have like a, a label or anything on where it came from and it's not dirty really so I'm wondering if um, somebody just set like a plant in its plastic pot inside of it which I'm guilty of uh, but I really really love this and it goes with my blue and white motif downstairs so I did pick up one item of clothing and it is this button-down shirt if you can see that yeah it is super sheer uh, tan snake print and what you can't really see is that it has a metallic threading all the way through it um, this was $5.99 it's originally from Dana Buckman which I think my mom said was like Dillard's brand or something like that it's a 3x so it's pretty oversized um, and it is as I said pretty sheer but um, I think this is gonna look super cute, French tucked into some jeans. So then, actually before I went to Goodwill, I went to Red Racks and I picked up a few things. There's Sunday sale, they have one tag every Sunday that's 75 cents and somehow I'd always been going on Saturday and never on Sunday. They also have a section of the store that on Sunday, their last chance section is 50 cents. So I got some items that were 75 cents, 50 cents, some were half off, and I think I got one item that was full price. So my one full price item was this little slip dress, and it was uh, $6.99, and it fits really nicely. I thought it would be really cute to wear to dinner at our honeymoon in Antigua. So um, I went ahead and picked this up. I think it's by Secret Treasures. Yeah, and it is in a size extra large. Um, I picked one item up from, oh, oh, there's a pot inside, hold on, <laughs> there's this little pot in here, um, it was half off, so, because it was blue, blue tags are half off, so this was $1.50, um, and I got this for another succulent, um, but this shirt was wrapped around that to make sure it didn't get damaged, it's this little um, extra large polo shirt, and so this was $0.50, cents. And if you can see, there's like a little stamp overneath, overneath, oh my god, a stamp over top that says $1, but um, on Sundays the $1 section is $0.50. Cents. So, pick this up. I also picked up um, a couple of pieces of stationery, I don't know where the other one is, it's probably at the bottom of the bag, but um, yellow tags were 25% off, so these were $0.75. Cents. Um, I'm always looking for little things like this for my um, my Poshmark sales. I send handwritten thank you notes with each of my Poshmark sales. So these are the cards that I picked up. So it's $10 or $10, <laughs> 10 cards for 75 cents, which is about what you get when you get the ones at Target that I have been getting, 
which are I think a dollar for eight cards. So that's cheaper. I did get two shirts that were 75 cents. Um, this is the first one. It's by Laura and Jane Two collection. It is polyester and it's a size 16 women's. Not really in my current um, neutral color palette that I've been doing more, um, but this is so soft and so comfortable, I had to pick it up. And for 75 cents, I could not pass it up. Okay, here's our other item. So these were six thank you cards. Um, they were tan, so they were 75 cents, and they just look like that. They have plastic on them, so they're making a really bad glare. There we go. There, now you can see them. Cute. So the last item in this bag was 75 cents as well, and it is this super cute little Ralph Lauren stripey shirt. I know I've seen this before. I know I tried it on before. Um, I think I tried it on when the tags were half off. Um, and this was $10, like price $10 at the thrift. So I was happy to get it for 75 cents. I think I tried it on and I was like, I don't $5 love it, but I 75 cents love it. So the last two pieces of clothing that I picked up were jeans. I am preparing for summer already because I can't with this weather. It is 60 degrees today, but it was like 12 yesterday. So um, I am preparing to turn jeans into shorts. If you are a plus size gal like myself and you wanna know how to do jeans to shorts, but a plus size version that keeps your thighs from, you know, friction city, uh, be sure to check that out on my channel. So I picked up this pair of Levi's. I couldn't believe it. Um, my store has a crap ton of Levi's, but they are all priced accordingly, except for this pair, which was blue tagged at $5.99, so it was half off, so I paid $3 for these Levi's. Um, they are a 550 fit in a size 40, and they're going to be turned into shorts, and I'm pumped. Uh, Levi's, are, Levi's are kind of like a toss-up with me on if they're going to fit or not. And I did not feel like taking my pants off today and trying on jeans. So I didn't try these on and I figure if they don't fit me, um, I can just turn them into shorts anyway and sell them on Poshmark or give them to a friend. Um, but I would think they would fit me. We'll see. So, um, but preparing for summer. <laughs> I do have one pair of thrifted Levi's that I turned into shorts and they are arguably one of my favorite pairs of shorts I've ever owned in my entire life. So um, I wanted to start early. So I picked those up. There was a pair of Wranglers that were going to be 75 cents but when I inspected them closer they had some stains that I really didn't think I could A overlook or B would be cut off when I turned them into shorts so I had to pass on those. So I'm just going to keep watching for that 75 cent sale and watching the jeans for 75 cents because there's something that appeals to me about buying a pair of vintage Levi's for 75 cents and turning them into shorts I just so the last item is probably my favorite um, another pair of denim of course these are vintage guest jeans I'm so pumped. I have one other pair of vintage guest denim. They are like the first pair of jeans I bought to turn into shorts. I think they were 38 and they were tight when I bought them. So I bought these, they are 40. They have the super old logo tag on them. Really, really cool, 100% cotton. These are 40 by 34s. And they have the really cool green little dude on the butt these are definitely gonna fit my thighs for sure um i also really like that they are a double button i don't have any shorts with a double button i think i have one pair that are full button and no zipper um but like how cool is that so um really excited about these probably gonna try these on after i wash them um but they were too cool for me to leave and they were 10.98 
and then blue tag so half off so 550 essentially for vintage guess denim super excited oh god okay so this is the other thing that i really love about guest jeans which is like a stupid thing but like when i buy vintage denim and i wear like a little crop top or something like a bodysuit i want to be able to see the really cool patch and sometimes i'm where i'll wear like a belt and then you can't see the patch but these ones you can fit your belt through the patch thank you like i think i'm probably gonna have to like peel the patch up on the levi's one and then like re-sew it so it doesn't get all screwed up but um a stupid thing to be excited about but i'm excited nevertheless so there you guys go i spent twenty dollars and some odd cents at red racks so a total of 33 bucks today which is pretty good considering the haul that i am staring at over here so um if you guys want more thrift videos let me know in the comments below subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll catch you in the next one love you warrior crew bye